everyone, welcome to the Lakeview video podcast series, and I'm pleased today to be joined with Don Granger with Miracle House Foundation out of Dallas, Texas. Nice to have you. Thank you for having me. It's really exciting to learn more about your program. Um, so Miracle House Foundation is a transitional living program for women, Yes. Um, and we're interested in hearing more about the program, but I'm first curious about your journey in starting the program. How did that come to be? Well, um, I'm in recovery, a woman in long-term recovery myself. Okay. Uh, my sobriety day is 825.03. I'm coming up on a birthday. Ooh, Ooh, that's God really. Yeah. And so it began there, mm -hmm. um, going into treatment myself. Mm -hmm. I was in residential treatment for seven months. Mm -hmm. And from treatment, I went to college and got my addiction counseling. Mm -hmm. And I just grew a passion, mm -hmm. and especially for women. Right. Um, I've worked with men and women, but I grew a passion for women because of myself, mm -hmm. being in recovery, mm -hmm. all of the issues. Mm -hmm. I went back to end up being the coordinator of the residential treatment center that I graduated from. Oh, good. So that was a yeah. huge experience, mm -hmm. and I believe like some of the catalysts of me opening the home. Mm -hmm. So I lived in California, mm -hmm. and in 08, I went to visit my niece in Dallas, mm -hmm. And it was a new home uh, facility. All the homes were new. And I took her dog for a walk one morning. Mm -hmm. And I saw this house. And I said, I'm going to get that house. Yeah. And I went back to Los Angeles. Uh -huh. Packed up everything. Wow. <laughs> and that's what everybody said. That's a call. You're doing what? Yeah, that's great. Uh, I don't know. And it was, a, I think, a lot of things mm -hmm. intertwined with that. As far as where I was in my recovery. Mm -hmm. I was like five years sober. Mm -hmm. You know, just branching off mm -hmm. on my own and mm -hmm. I felt like I could do it mm -hmm. and so I moved to Dallas in 08 and I worked two full-time jobs and bought a brand new house. My goodness and so now that's your passion. That's, that's your my passion. That's the road. That's fantastic mm -hmm. and and it's done a lot so the program is very much steeped in 12 steps. It's got a really strong spirituality bone. It's got really strong recovery coaching. Yes. But what was most impressive is that 75 percent of the people that you've worked with you've been able to work closely with through CPS as far as reuniting children and moms Yes together. that's one of my baby signature programs. So tell, tell us about the Mommy and Me program. Mommy and Me sort of is like the women with reunification. Mm -hmm. They don't have their children there at the house, okay. but what we do is we connect with outside organizations that specifically cater to women with substance abuse mm -hmm. and children. Mm -hmm. So there's an organization that I work closely with. If the women, they go to, every Saturday they go to parenting, mm -hmm. and that's mandatory. And then they get to get themselves on a housing list. And this program actually has apartments mm -hmm. that the women are able to get, and it's through HUD, mm -hmm. so they get Section 8. It's an 18-month program, mm -hmm. and so we collaborate with that program to help the women work Here. through CPS. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I have a subpoena now. I go to court for the women mm -hmm. as long as they are in their 12-step program and working as to reuniting with their children. It sounds great because so many of our women, that's one of the biggest barriers for them is it finding is. care for their kids while they're in treatment and then post-treatment. So it sounds like you've really filled a gap. Yeah, I'm definitely trying to do that. And I just did a grant um, and I'm working on more grants to help women who are pregnant and opiate users. Oh, wow. So that's the next specific mm -hmm. uh, population that I'll be working with because there's a lot in mm -hmm. that area that needs to be helped well, because they're turned away yeah. because mm -hmm. of the different medications. Mm -hmm. So I'm really hoping in 17 that I'll be able to house at least mm -hmm. a portion of the house mm -hmm. to uh, pregnant moms. Fantastic. Well, it sounds like you've definitely found your calling and you've found a gap to fill, which is terrific in Dallas. Yes. And so um, if folks wanted to learn more about Miracle for House Foundation, how would they get in touch with you? They would go to our website which is www.themiraclehousefoundation.org and they could reach us right through that website as well as you know navigate through the site to see all the different programs that we do offer. Wonderful. Thanks Dawn for taking the time to visit us. Thank you for having me. For those of you that are interested in learning more about Lakeview Health, we invite you to visit us at lakeviewhealth.com or if you know someone that needs treatment right away, please call us at 866-887-0142.